Hello guys, this is Tyler here, and welcome back to Con Zombies. Today we're going to play on the map 5 on Solo, so let's get right into it. For time and the world, do not oh yeah, this map has like an animated cutscene, which is pretty cool. Those who look only so let's watch it. Or the present are certain to miss the future. I said, are certain to miss the future. <laughs> oh no. I missed that. Prime Minister Castro, this missile crisis was the last straw. We almost blew ourselves up. Now, we invited you here today. In good faith. In good faith. To sort this thing out. And why is he here? He lost. As I always say, forgive your enemies, but remember their names. Now, gentlemen, as I like to think, in the long history of the world, that there are only a few generations... Sounds like someone breaking in! It's just a storm, Dick. Sit down. <laughs> it's kind of weird how these cutscenes only play a single player. Zombies. Or a solo. Our capacity to retaliate must be and has to be massive to deter all forms of aggression. Gentlemen, lock and load. Viva la revolución! Any last words, Mr. President Gustav? Any superlative words of inspiration for our humble troops? Do not pray for easy lives, my friends. Pray to be stronger men. Wait a minute, look at all these weapons they have. And here I am, starting with a pistol. You know what I'm saying? It's a bit of cognitive dissonance, but whatever. Major systems online. Uh, can we go find the power switch? Like I said, this map is pretty hard for me on solo. These every time so I can make it past round I six. Guess this means I have to help. But it's a pretty cool map to me. Man, I think it's swift to lot of shots right there. Anyway, I learned a couple things about playing this game. I've been playing for like a while. Ammo. Since I started playing like Damn since. Since I started playing since uh... Man, hug it. Man, call it checkers. I started playing this game since, well, last weekend. It's now Friday, so congratulations to me Friday and all. And, uh, I've learned a couple of things. Don't let any zombies get even a smidge near you, especially during the beginning of the game. You can get, like, double swiped and down pretty easily. It's pretty, an it's really annoying. Like, the fact that you can get down in just two hits is re- is really frustrating. Like, it would be fine if- if it was only, like, three hits. Well, it- well, it is only in three hits on some occasions, but don't really count- there's best sense to count on it. Most of the time, you can get down in two hits. Well, consecutive- consecutive hits. You want to like regenerate elf after all. Anyway, where where was that weapons closet? Okay, okay, too close. Like in the cutscene, like like the main four guys, you got hold of some weapons, and yet I still start with a pistol. No cuddle, no. That sounds pretty unfair, if you ask me. Well, this I can work with. Like at least give me a reason why 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 all the survivors start with pistols. 
kind of ruins the immersion. Actually, not kinda. It really remove ruins the immersion. Oh no! <sighs> that sucks. See what I mean? You can instantly get double swiped just like that. Now I lost five five hundred points. I guess this means I have to help. Important note, always aim for headshots. <laughs> anyway, if you know what you're doing, these zombie rounds in last a while. Alright. Gonna wait a bit. Okay. Man, I always get power ups at the worst times. Like you, like you, like you would not believe. I, like I always get really good power ups at the end of. Oh, gee, okay. I was about to get double swiped again. Oh, I really need to watch it out. The bloodiest wars in history involve buttercups and hippies. Oh, come on. Uh, like, like if it was a guaranteed three hits to you, dude. Only when he quits. It would make the game a lot more fun. I guess this means I have to help. But it isn't. Now I've lost the revive scene. One potato, two potato, three potato, blah! Alright. Let's get down. Well, this is the end of the game, because when I die the most. It's because of these stupid narrow corridors. That I keep dying to, each every time. And there's too many windows for me to actually beat them. Stinking points. I need your bones. Death machine. Right, death machine. Wow, I actually got a power up at the right time. At the exact time I needed it. Take no risks. Suffer no defeats. Take no risks. Win no victories. I fixed the death machine, I'm pretty just steam I pretty much steamrolled for that man. I want your blood and I want your vote. If that's all you got, maybe I'm not talking enough. Right. Hey. This thing will find this is the sort of thing they like. 
Alright. Is there a mystery box in here? No. And I'm up here. I gotta clear obstacles. Okay. Okay. So I haven't, so I haven't gotten Juggernaut yet, so I gotta be yeah, real careful. Go and tell me something I don't know. Did, did I really take damage from that? I, I was like miles away from that explosion. My lord, they smell worse than a checker's car. Look at the filthy carpets. And it's already the end of the round. It's the kill. And I have no weapons. Action's revenge. <laughs> oh, I feel and I'm up now. here. That has additional component. Okay, I'm really running out of ammo here. Yes, I guess I have to go fight now. So far, lead me. Okay, just where I needed to be. Right. Okay, I think that's all the zombies that could that are threat to me. Yeah, they're only crawlers now. Okay, so what a good strategy most people do is like leave like one crawler zombie alive and and so they can have like a nice little break and do what they need to do like open mystery boxes and stuff like that. This is what I'm doing right now. What's in what's in here? Okay, there's a okay, there's a box. In here. I don't have any money to actually use that. So I guess camping here would be... So I guess camping here would be a good idea. Wait, what? I deserve a celebrity discount. I don't have enough money to get... Uh... I don't have enough money to get, uh... Ammo. So let's repair some of these barriers. There you go. Alright. Shut up! Just shut up! 
Right, let me just wait for the next round to come in. Oh, okay, what was that? Uh, yeah, like, I was just jerked to the side a bit. Yeah. Okay, so I'm doing this thing called training. I'm gonna try to gather the horde of zombies to, like, one arch forward so I can move them down with my gun. God, why? Avoiding death is not the same as living. I get it. Look at what happened there. Was stupid. It was, it's just stupid. Open, open. And great. I lost my last quick revive. So this is a, wait a minute. Is that all the zombies? I think so. The bloodiest wars in history involve buttercups and hippies. Oh, that's a zombie. Okay. Okay, if I do things correctly, I could I could train them around the area. Oh. Detected on level three. Oh. Initiate security protocol one one five. Empty. I'm empty, Dag Nabbit. Where is he? Come on. Where? Oh my god, I lost it, didn't I? I ate that guy. And I just lost my gun. If anything can't get any worse. You're now a death gone too. <sighs> we are now a death gone three. Okay. Le leading the zombies. All right. If that's all you got, maybe I'm not talking enough. I can lie, that's a lot longer than I usually are. Yeah. Oh, well, guys, I guess that's the end of that. Oh. See you guys tomorrow, and thanks, thanks for watching.